What's up guys, it's the FIFA Gambler coming at you again today to bring you another player review on one of the most powerful strikers in the game, Mario Balotelli. Um, personally, he's my favorite striker to use, so when I got word that he was coming out with the team of the season in form, I was really excited to try him out. Um, this here is the squad I decided to use in a 3-5-2 with Muriel up top. He, I mean, these guys are a lethal combination up top, and if you haven't seen my 1 million coin squad builder video yet, I'd recommend tuning into that too. That's a... This this team right here, if you have a million coins to drop, this is probably one of the best teams that you could buy with that with that amount of coins. Um, his in-game stats, they're blown up. Uh, his ball control, every everything is just blown up. His acceleration, his pace, his dribbling, agility, strength, shot power, free kicks, finishing, they're all way above average. Um, not to mention he's six foot two, huge frame, and just powers right through everybody. Um, comparison, I tried to compare him to somebody I really couldn't. Um, he's he kind of just stands alone as what I believe to be the best striker in the game. Um, his strengths, his strength is his strength. I mean, as I discussed before, with this guy's acceleration, pace, and agility, he's very easy to maneuver around defenders. And if somebody ends up catching him, he kind of just powers right through him. Um, He's got an awesome first touch, awesome shot power, and like I discussed in my previous video regarding quickness of shot, he's definitely up there with an extremely quick release. Um, I do, however, think he's more of a power shot kind of guy compared to a finesse guy, so um, I didn't mess around too much with that. Um, if you like to use skill moves, this can also be your guy, four-star skills. Um, long shots, I, I, I took him with both feet, he's four-star weak foot. Made some ridiculous shots with with both feet. Um, 98 shot power and 89 long shots, so he's pretty good at those. Also, um, his heading is quite good, except for I, I used him to take my corner kicks. Um, I scored a lot of corner kicks when he took took my corner kicks, it, just because his free kick stats, and they're, they're so good. But um, weaknesses, pretty, pretty much I don't really have any weaknesses for this guy. He's He kind of just, I mean, I guess the only thing I could really say is his balance, because it comes in at 51. But, um, I mean, that's really if you're just coming up against some guys like David Luiz or Cialini back there who might be able to catch you. And if they do catch you, they can probably push you off the ball a little bit and mess with his balance. But uh, I didn't really have, have much trouble with that. Um, recap, the positive and negatives. Um, very good pace. Um, very strong. Above average free kicks. Awesome dribbler uh, for a big, strong guy. Four-star skills, four-star weak foot, awesome finisher, and, again, no no weaknesses. Um, based on all this information, I gave him a 10 out of 10, no, no doubt. I probably won't ever give another player a 10 out of the 10, but he deserved it. Um, pretty much that's all I got for you guys. Thanks for watching, and um, if you like this video, leave a like, comment. Um, thanks again for watching, and subscribe to the FIFA Gambler. Have a good one.